Hello, I am your host, Magic Cow Stallion. Oh yeah. Anyways, thanks for clicking on the video, and if you want to see more, please like, comment, and subscribe down below, and also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and also Twitch, where I'll be streaming gaming and more. Thank you very much, and let's -a watch. Welcome to another video of mine on Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, or what I like to call it. Smash, 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 can't have an invasion without me! Do not invoke the wrath of the Arcade Elite! <laughs> Hello and welcome to another video of Smama Smash 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 Think Me Smash Smash Alonion! And today we are gonna go over the final character before the game comes out, which is Invader Sim. And I grew up with Invader Zim. A lot of people grew up with Invader Zim. I really did enjoy the show back in the day. Um, Zim with his robot girl that was like, I think it was like um, defunct. Well, not defunct, like defective. Uh, robot um, given to him by the almighty Talus. And they were just trying to get rid of Zim. And I remember Deb, the earth kid that's always trying to expose him but no one's believing him um, um his sister who's just playing her game all the time dib sister who's playing her game all the time it, it doesn't want nothing to do with him the show was fun i missed the dad <laughs> the dad was pretty cool um dib's dad but besides that i wonder how he's gonna play um, I wonder what stage he's gonna have. Let's see. Let's check. Find out. Let's -a watch. All right. Let's see what we got here. Hey, everybody. My name is Thaddeus Cruz from the Nickelodeon All Star Brawl development team. Okay, and so today, he has the technical backpack, the of course. Set of the egotistical urchin invader, Zim. Zim is a slow and light brawler who likes to throw traps and use his companion Gur to limit the movement of his Gurr. opponents and punish any aggressors. He excels oh, at ambushing the, brawlers by putting them between a rock the and a hard place. Land um, Time to ornaments sow doom on your that were traps. The lawn ornaments that were traps. Let's begin planning for Earth's conquest with Zim's light attacks. Right. Zim's light neutral is. Spider poke. His light up is boosted kick. And his light down is spider spin. That looks pretty good. Let's talk about Zim's oh, air light. Oh, the effects. um the air version is um looking better. Zim's light neutral air is oh, that's spider the neutral windmill. His light up air is Aerial Spider Poke. And his light down air is Leg Stretch. Zim's light dash attack is Spider Jab. Is it a double jab? Let's move on to World Domination Phase 2 with Zim's strong hmm. attacks. Zim's strong neutral is burning lasers. His strong oh, okay. up is shock spear. Standard issue for the Urkin Ah, uh, I remember that. And his strong that. down is doom. Hmm. Let's go over Zim's air strong attacks. Zim's oh, the the um the is... teddy bear. Aerial Burning Lasers! His strong up air is... Aerial Shock Spear! And his strong down air is... I like this stage. The Ultimate Tool of Destruction! I'm trying to remember who's that Zim's in the monitor in the background. I know it's not 
Spider Saw. The tallest. Let's now observe the deviousness of Sim's inventions with his special attacks. That might be a tallest in disguise, Sim's but I don't think so. Is... <laughs> Gurr. Oh, girl wants a hug. Gurr appears next to Zim, running automatically. He can be commanded to stop and start again by pressing special. Oh, that's pretty cool. Or jump by using a neutral light attack. Ah! Well, I Gurr makes think he did that before, and I wasn't paying attention. Dealing damage. Also, if you hit Gurr on his way with a Wait. light attack, he will switch directions. Ooh! Alright, Gurr's gonna be a lot of fun. Zim's up special is... Bombs away! He launches into the air and drops a bomb below that explodes on impact. And his down special is... Lawn Gnome. He deploys a robotic Lawn Gnome that hangs in midair and deals area of effect damage for a set amount of time. Deploying a new Gnome destroys the previous one. Okay. And lastly, here's Zim's taunt move. Uh -huh. Zim's stage is... Urken Armada Invasion! This is a medium-sized stage with three platforms. Looks like the Urken fleet is mobilizing. Yeah. This is Planet Lorch's doom pretty much assured. battlefield. Now, let's witness Zim unleash Eternal Doom on his right. enemies. Hold on right quick. I wanted to see something right here, but um like something back but yeah this is pretty much just battlefield it's kind of weird seeing that battlefield is going to be the last stage that we see but it works i like the logo um of the um i think that's zim's logo right there in the middle of the stage on the bottom long platform Slightly to the left instead of like um, direct middle, but you know what I mean. But there is something I want to uh, hear. Like, can he self destruct it himself or it, it's just self destruct on the touch? Also, if you hit Gurr on his way with a light attack, he will switch directions. And it has to be a light attack? Also. Hold on. When Gurr makes contact with an opponent, he self destructs. Dealing damage. Alright, so it Fixed is. contact with an opponent, he's. Or jump by using a neutral light attack. Okay, so it's only if he touched somebody. When Gurr makes contact with an opponent, he self destructs. Dealing damage. Alright. I'm pretty sure he's gonna get. Uh, gonna be able to be grabbed. And if that's the case, if the character throws him, will he just automatically self-destruct or will he also start walking himself? That'll be interesting to see. And I also wonder what happens if you use a um, strong attack on him. Is he just going to self-destruct right there or get um, not to, uh, like fleeing like very far? I don't know. Um, but Gur is definitely the... Looks like the most important tool in order to use, at least to me, he looks the most fascinating and he looks like um, what's going to be used a lot and a lot of what his gameplay is going to be centered around. That's what it looks like to me. I'm not a pro, but that's what I'm seeing right now. Also, if you hit Gurr on his way with a light attack, he will switch directions. I want to see if he does mention the um, heavy. Zim's up special is... No, he's not going to do that. Alright, so let's hurry up and get to... That was the stage. Alright. Let's witness Zim unleash Eternal Doom on his enemy. In a real match. Ready? Three, two. All right, let's one. see what he can do. Let's see what he can do. Oh, the land gnome is gonna be annoying. So is that uh, neutral error? 
can you grab the land? Oh, um, no. Okay. Ooh, a heavy attack just destroys it. Oh, the ship was refueling the stage. Okay, so a heavy, um, a strong attack does, like, make him self-destruct on you. Mmm, I like that. Yeah, okay. Land Gnome and Girl. And the winner is Zim. Land, Land Gnome and that's Zim. is going to be Thank you crazy. Thank you very much for tuning in to this character showcase. And please look yeah, forward to more Honestly, like these um, after seeing that, I think it's honestly going to be used a little more than Girl. So kind of scratch my... The thing that I was saying earlier. That Land Gnome... Like, Girl was just more interesting... So, I like how you, um, you the light attacks make him turn around. You can make him jump. You can make him stop. He's just like this walking nuisance. But at the same time, he might be able to be thrown. So, that's what I was asking about. But Gur is definitely going to be used a lot. But that land gnome is also going to be very annoying, especially off stage. All right, we're going to see what's going to happen. But that's definitely the last character that we are able to see before the actual game comes out, which will be, like, later. <laughs> so, unless I'm get, I get the game, I'll go over it. I'll try and see what's the other game modes. Let's see if we have arcade, story mode, etc. But he's looking good. He looked like he's going to be um, fun. That land gnome is going to be crazy. Oh, that's going to be super annoying, <laughs> that, that land gnome. Oh, God. Oh, mm, mm. I'm just thinking about it. Yeah, no. Ooh. He's probably going to be pretty good. Yeah. But that's what's going in my mind right now. Either way. Sweet! You made it to the end! You stallion you! Anyways, thank you very much for watching the video. And if you'd like to see more, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch where I'll be streaming gaming and more. As I take you on a magical journey where we shall all become stallions. Yeah. Anyways, y'all take care, be safe, and remember stallions. Give me that!